No, this isn't this is new way stuff. This is just uh, trying out the turtle control stuff, which has been known. I just haven't gotten around to doing it yet. This isn't even like speed run stuff. This is just like I want to try out turtle control. Testing Franker B. If I don't think anyone's made Franker B into a um, into an actual like hex payload yet. I mean, I guess Glank might have like the details on it. I don't know. I wonder if Glank has like a pace bin for the whole the whole payload. Wait, I wasn't counting. Hold on. I need to count. Oh no. <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna crash. I mean I got it. I I did get past the file I did get past the character limit. I just I wanted to reset it because I need to count to 39 and I wasn't counting. I do know it worked though. It definitely did work. Okay, so I have to redo the whole thing. Congrats on my first file select crash. Thanks. How do I get rid, of, get rid of Navi? You can only call Navi here. This won't, like, get rid of Navi, right? No, oh, get rid of Navi. Um, I think I'm just gonna have to cancel the macro near the end. And... Or wait. Oh, you know what? No, this never goes into C-Up. Because I just tasked it myself. Okay, it's fine. Can you ace a better Pokemon game? Probably. I mean, if that Pokemon game fits into 4 megabytes. Well, I guess if you're a Gen 1-er. If you actually like the the better Pokemon games that are a bit bigger in file size, then no, you're a Gen One or sure. Okay. I I literally just told myself, don't do that. Um, can Order sixty six be executed with Total Control? I mean, you can type in Order sixty six into your file name and then execute it. It'll probably crash, but. I guess that would technically fulfill the requirements. How's multiplayer OOT going? We're almost there. We're gonna we're gonna make multiplayer OOT with total control. I don't know where. Okay, wait. Here, weebs. I need you guys to help me. Where do I find this? Left side. Oh, down one, left two. Oh, there it is. Okay. Uh. I might have been supposed- I might have supposed to have been doing this later? Oh, I was not supposed to be moving the control stick there. Uh, I don't know if I'm on yes or no. No. Uh, where am I? <laughs> what if I just do this? Okay, wait, I might have- Am I back to where I want to be? Am I back to the beginning? Okay. Alright, I got back to the beginning. Without crashing. Uh oh. How far can I go? I have a feeling that this isn't a good idea. Now I especially have a feeling this isn't a good idea. Actually, now I think it's a really good idea. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not trying to mash fast because I want to actually see if like weird stuff happens, like that. Just B, just B out. Okay. Huh. That looks like a nice file. I choose file two. I look like I'm running a bit faster, but... Go to tree forest. I'm definitely faster. Okay, I have long rolls. Rip. This is total control. I have total control over crashing the game. You wrote the payload wrong. Wow. Let's see. There's an old, uh, there's an old clip here. 
for like getting to Goma's room early. I can't believe the speed doesn't clip. Wow. Don't crash. Okay, I'm scared to go through a load trigger. Build up speed for 12 hours. Oh, is it really an adult only clip? I guess. Well, I guess I've only seen it as adult now that I think about it, but I never thought of it as like adult only or child only. Uh, I don't want to go through the load plane. I'm scared of load planes. Uh. Rip. That's why I was scared. I didn't want to go that way. What are you looking at? Total control arbitrary code execution. I mean, I don't know if I should keep messing with that payload specifically, because that's kind of like... I mean, it's neat, but it's just... Bored now. I don't know what to do from here. Open payload B dot Z64. Yeah, there's not really like a good... A good, like, meaningful payload, I guess. It's kind of just like a bunch of messing around stuff, which I, would, I do want to mess around, but at the same time, it's like... You guys think I should try the whole thing on console? Only to crash within, like, two minutes. How big of a payload would R-Wings be? Turn turn the Babas in uh, around Decatry into into R wings. They can do easy. Okay, go go give me an R wing payload and I'll set it up on console. R wing R wing as in the thing from Star Fox, except it's also from Ocarina of Time. Okay, so the goal of this is I have to do arbitrary code execution with this file name. Nothing will really it won't appear like anything happens, but I do it with this file name. I go die and go back to the title screen without resetting the game. I delete the file. I make a new one with another file name. I play the game up to arbitrary code execution again. I execute that file name. Again, won't really look like anything happens. I go die, back to the title screen, make a third file, repeat, and after the third file, I should have total control in the file select menu. Also, if I crash at any time, I have to start over. So I have to do ace three times in a row, no crashes. Yeah, that's the best part. And this is just phase one. Yeah, the whole three three character or three file names thing is all of phase one. What am I gonna do with this power? I don't know. Probably small little things. I'll spawn some more wings with the help of Mr. Cheese's payload. Uh, you could put Mario in Zelda. Yes, it would probably be way too much work for anyone to actually do because, like. There's a difference between possible and if anyone's actually going to bother doing it, because these payloads are all based on typing in characters on the file select screen, and if you're actually typing in, like, enough code to, like, actually put Mario in Zelda, that's going to be very long. Oh my god, Volv, yeah. <laughs> my god, that'd be perfect. No, so what, what Volv's talking about is there, there was this old run that was submitted to the leaderboards where someone used a mod to change Link's character model to Mario and someone actually accepted the run it got it actually got verified it got removed a long time later but uh so the idea would be use Ace to make that real I wonder if you could change Ganon into Bowser too I mean I'm sure you could but I would guess that two full character model swaps would probably be a nightmare all right, they get to it. Man, this is great. What a time to be alive, yeah. We're unironically talking about doing a speedrun where you change Link's model to Mario in the game and submit it as a speedrun time and get it accepted because it's not actually cheating. Yeah, writing, writing a whole Linkin Park song in an N64 sound file sounds like it'll be very difficult. Just listening to the song is very difficult. True. Dude, imagine how many times whoever's making the payload ha is gonna have to listen to that to make sure it's correct. You're actually gonna have to listen to it over and over and over. Alright, payload three. Why play the same game every day? Why not play Raid Shadow Legends? You know what? I should play Raid Shadow Legends. That new hot game that... How do I... How do I finish the... the ad? I don't even know what to say for it. I want to pretend like I'm doing the ad, but I actually don't know anything about it. Ace Raid Shadow Legends into OOT. Great idea. 
Uh, if I fail, I have to start over, basically. So, I have to do that. I have to do all three. I have to do Ace with all three file names in a row without turning off the console or resetting it. Uh, but, like, if I reset where, just say, the rocks are loaded, then I can just reload the area and try again instead of actually having to reset and redo everything again. But, say, if I crash or something, then I have to redo and start from the beginning. So, I have... Right now, I have all three files saved in Deku Tree right before Ace. So I have to do Ace on all three of them without resetting, without turning off the game. Yeah, if it crashes, I have to go back to the beginning. I have to, like, say I'm on the third one and I crash, then I have to go back to file one and do Ace three times again. No crash? No crash, okay. Let me just make sure the rock is loaded to make sure that... It for sure works. Okay, yeah. Okay. Ace 1 has been done successfully. Part 1 of 3. Okay, so now I have to go to the next file to do this, but I can't reset, so I have to die and not continue. No, one Ace uh, doesn't remove the file name. I have to do Ace 3 times, so all three... Ace with all three of these file names will remove the limit. That was file name 1. So now we do two. No crash. No crash. Phase two should be complete. No crash. No crash. All right. Everything should be set up. Okay, I don't see the... I don't see the sparks, like, when Link gets hit, so that's good. Every time it's worked, that's happened, so... No save, no continue. Alright. So I want to delete file 1. And delete file 3. And I want to input stuff in file 1. Alright, this this part will probably take a while, by the way. You might want to go get a snack.